Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? Um, I don't know how many of you are familiar with this uh, software. It's called a virtual desktop, and what's so unique about it is the fact that um, you can go ahead and choose many different backgrounds while you are in virtual reality. You can watch your desktop for example like right here i'm in a home cinema theater and you can feel like you're inside this home theater cinema and you can uh, go ahead and play your video games like this you can watch your movies like this there's a variety of different options which i'm going to show you in a minute uh, and it's pretty cool man uh, you can adjust the lights you know, dim the lights turn the lights on and off um, let me show you, for example, like right here, there, you see the desktop just shows up. Now to you, it will show up popping up, but for me, it shows up on the screen. Uh, you know what I mean? So, uh, let me just show you one example really quick, uh, right here, as you can see, my desktop is there on the screen uh, I can go ahead and browse the internet if I like I can do that uh, or I can just simply um, let me see something I don't have any movies at the moment on my hard drive because I just got this computer but then let me show you the different types of options uh, you see right here uh, you can choose uh, what type of uh, background environment would you like? Uh, there's a home cinema. There's a home theater. Uh, my favorite one is home cinema, but there's another cool ones they have over here, like deep space. You see, like when you go to deep space right here, you can adjust the screen. Uh, how, how big do you want it? Do you want your screen to be small or big you can choose a distance between the screen you can go close zoom in zoom out so pretty cool also when you're watching a videos you can choose uh, how do you want your videos to be like let's say you download a uh, 360 video virtual reality video you would normally choose side by side click sphere or dome 1080 and then you would go over here and then open it or you would go to the the youtube for example uh, uh all you have to do is copy and paste and put it here and then the uh the video would show up same thing with the photos you can uh watch the 360 photos here as well um and um it's pretty cool. They got many different ones. Uh, you can play video games like this if you like. But the, the thing is, um, I cannot show you the video game because it will only show up in, in, in the full screen 2D. You guys won't be able to see it like in virtual reality. Only I can see it. But what's so cool about when you start the video game, it shows up as a holographic 3d virtual reality uh screen and it looks pretty cool you can play video games like this you can uh watch movies like this uh like i said my favorite it's a home cinema well we go to the home theater this is a home theater right here let me show it to you a little bit more and it looks pretty cool um, this these are the seats there's a projector right there and um You know, this is only like, what, $13. It's really not that expensive. Uh, and uh, if you have Oculus Rift, you definitely need to buy this. You definitely need to purchase this software. It's so cool. It's so much fun, man. I'm having so much fun with this. Uh, and for some videos, actually, you will need this virtual uh, desktop software. If you want to watch YouTube 360 videos and other things, but this is really done well, and uh, for $13, definitely worth it. 
this is the home theater one. There's a uh, another one which is my favorite, the cinema one. That's the one I like. Uh, let me click on the cinema right here. This is the one that's uh, cinema one. That's the one I like. And looks pretty cool. Now here, let me show you. There's some movies over here. You see there's a rear speakers there in the back. Speaking of speakers, I need to go and buy some speakers pretty soon as well. Uh, there's the rear ones there in the back. This is your little tablet. Now, I don't have my Oculus Touch controllers hooked up. I turned them off. Uh, but yes, you can use the Oculus Touch to move around, touch things and, and whatnot. So you do have that option as well. You can also use your Xbox One as controller or the mouse for that matter. Uh, but here, look at this, man. Look how cool this is. Look at all these movies, Strange Days, Source Code. Uh, Avatar, these are all like the top notch movies. Tron, Vanilla Sky, uh, all the great classic movies, man. So, um, yeah, this is pretty cool, man. If you guys don't have virtual desktop and you have Oculus Rift, man, you definitely need to buy it, man. It's only $13. I mean, you're going to spend 40 bucks or 20 bucks or some short tech technical demo or a game. With this, you're getting a huge benefit. And this is a great software. I highly recommend it. So anyway, there you go, guys. It's just a short little video. I just wanted to show you how it looks. Uh, it looks great. It looks fantastic. Uh, yes, I can stand up. I can show you around. There's couple of bottles of wine right here uh, as you can see there's the uh, speakers there and uh, there you go i might watch some movies like this just to see how it is i might play some video games like this as well just to see how it feels you know uh but it's pretty cool pretty cool definitely so they have it guys Hopefully you enjoyed this video, and uh, today you might see me do some uh, unboxing of uh, that Samsung 4K monitor. You might see me do that, but I also need to buy some uh, speakers as well, man. I, I know I've been saying it. I'm going to go with some Polk speakers, T50s, uh, and then later on I'll mix it up with uh, some more Polk speakers, and then subwoofers, I'll go with the Klipsch. And then up firing speakers, I might go with a Klipsch or Klipsch. That's how it's called. And um, yeah, man, that's pretty much it. That's all I have for you guys. Hopefully you enjoy this. There's so many other features uh, that this software has. I don't have time to go through all of them. I might do like a full official 45 minute video on this to show you some other cool features. But uh like I said, if you have Oculus Rift, uh, you should definitely buy this. I mean, it's 13 bucks. I mean, it's really affordable. I mean, $13. It's not that bad. All right. So, I mean, technically it's $14, $13.99, but still, even $14, it's not that bad. It's still worth it. All right, guys. Well, there you have it. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.